to the Elkhorn High School cooking competition. For team one here, we have Victoria Bashara <laughs> yes! and in the Taylor McKay. Yes! And, uh, in our red aprons, we have Brady Larry and Anna Froscheiser. Yes. Yes. Today, you can see that the uh, topic today is breakfast. You have to prepare a breakfast plate. Make it as many items as you want, but try to make them taste good and creative. And at the end, the total plate will also be judged as well. Um, however, there's a fourth factor besides taste, creativity, and presentation. Our three mystery ingredients today are barbecue sauce, Lucky Charms, and cutie oranges. Contestants must introduce two of these into their dish in any way possible. And the more creative, the better. You guys ready? Yeah. You have 30 minutes to make breakfast. I have to share. You most definitely will have to. Cereal pancakes. Anna, Anna, Anna Brochet, right off the bat, grabs pancake batter and lime juice. So we have three amazing judges here today, all with varying levels of uh, food expertise, we call it. Uh, the first, the lovely Miss Waylon. Hello. Waylon, how much are you? What's your food? food I would call myself a foodie with a couple of memorable exceptions that I don't like to mix up. And I'm allergic to apples because that's my weird. But otherwise, I consider myself a foodie. Right. And then uh, we have the food's teacher, probably with the most expertise, Ms. Milliken. Hi, guys. Uh, my food expertise, yeah. I've been teaching foods for many, many, many years. A lot longer than you guys have been around. Okay. Yeah, she can make minute rice okay. for sure. Okay. Yeah. <laughs> and then we have probably the person with the least amount of expertise. Definitely. Uh, your assistant principal, Mr. Gibbons. Hello. Yeah, I have no expertise whatsoever. I just need it. What can you What can you cook? What can I cook? What can you cook? Um, toast. Okay. Cereal. Fox mac if you have the instructions. Yeah, I can do mac and cheese. I can do a, I can do a frozen pizza. Easy mac. This guy's good. This guy, I mean, five star Michelin. Yeah. Oh, yeah. Alright, so today our judges are going to be judging contestants on four things. Creativity, taste, presentation, and how they introduce their mystery item into the whole food. So right now we're making cakes with a little bit of lemon just for the Oh just, no! Yeah. So I, we just watched Brady put lime juice in the pancake batter. You said lemon juice. Lemon juice, okay. Citrus juice. Okay. So <laughs> immediately shared a story about oh another famous teacher. So John Backus is famous for his uh, lunch that he eats every day, that it is the exact same lunch that he eats every day. So one, one year for lunch, we made him go out to First Watch, and he looked at the menu as if he never heard these words. So we told him the lemon ricotta pancakes are delicious. He ordered them. It's now the only thing he ever orders at First Watch any location. So lemon ricotta pancakes. Back is a break. Shout out to JB. Victoria and Taylor. <laughs> the black what do you guys have? We got some we actually have some French toast situation. I love it. Oh no. All the talent. I'm assuming your hey, favorite breakfast food just really before good. our contestants bring out their yeah. rendition of it. Your <laughs> favorite breakfast food would be um, like waffles or French yeah. toast, something like that. Maybe a cinnamon roll. I, I do like breakfast. I like a lot of breakfast foods. Um, I think French toast is right away. That's one of my favorites. But I do like a good egg casserole. Isn't it egg casserole? Can we get a more? It's like that for breakfast. I think we're going to have French toast would make all of us very happy. I enjoy French toast. You can do French oh, toast so many different ways and add so many it. toppings and specialize it that it's highly customized. I see no French so toast being cooked. No, no, I don't see. Victoria's group, they're doing She's French toast. Team a waffle French toast. Oh, waffle French toast. I've actually done that. It's really good. Okay. Is that, is that bacon? I've also yeah. done a Krispy Kreme yeah. donut and a waffle maker. And some bacon. Oh, yeah. that's a great life yeah. decision. Oh, yeah. That's good. You guys yes. ever had a donut grilled cheese? Like oh, yeah. Yes. You can only have one, or else you'll be in a coma for the rest of the day. No, it, it is an interesting concept. Let me so me. Bella's once a week does a donut burger. Oh, donuts yeah. instead of buns. Yeah. I haven't you tried it yet. Can I give you a costume tomorrow? Victoria and Taylor, give us a status update. How are things rolling so far? Good. So far, so good. Oh, we don't need that much.
Butter. We're going to break yeah, our, our French toast situation oh, happening okay. with our mystery ingredient. Making some eggs. We can heat up some ham yeah. here. Bacon. Bacon is going. Bacon. Is there anything going on with the pancake that should be promoted? Um, it'll be a surprise. Yeah, yeah, yeah. <laughs> so you can get like a meat factor. Oh, that's good. Oh, my God. Do we watch TV? Oh, my God. We've got a bit of a flip of TV. What is it? Yeah. Well, that one's going to be a little bit more. What's that one? Let's just see what it's going to be. Oh, oh my gosh. <laughs> you know, we got lots of eyes. Oh my gosh. Okay. <laughs> Brady is cooking these pancakes. Wait, do you guys, judges, I have a question. So, I don't know, but Brady's making his pancakes about medium rare. Do you guys want to have that video? Looking over what, what the black team is doing, this is really interesting. So you guys made a pizza. Yes, we have made a breakfast. Hey, let's pick. Wow. Yeah. This looks really good. I don't know what's going on with the waffles, but I'm very excited. Oh, that's a lot of ham. Ham looks a little but I think they're going to get it together. This is an experiment. I love it. Don't tell me. How confident are you in eating Brady? Okay, back on the table. Nice and gentle, because that's a box. Yeah. Yeah. Are you going to put that like, face down? No, I'm going to roll it up. I know Gibbons probably gave you an after hours, but this is just a, a cruel revenge. <laughs> <laughs> it's so you love sugar. Okay. You guys so, are the... Just kidding. Uh, well, okay. Yeah, so look uh, for it. Are you utilizing the sifter? Okay, we're going to like it. Okay, that's going to be that. Is that going to happen? I think it's going to happen. Oh, there's already towels. If the glass glass was good, replace it for us. Oh my gosh, that looks good. I would also like to point out just the, um, just the uh, cleanliness of the different sizes. It's pretty, we, we, we definitely got a, kind of like an east versus west Berlin thing going on where it's like between the walls, there's just, it's not even there. A three, two, one. Oh, it's like the one. All right, time is up. Uh oh. All right, everybody, put your utensils and whatnot down. Oh, I'm gonna cancel that. Timer off. 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 Can get some up here? We describe it. Tell us. Okay, so this is our our well-rounded breakfast. Because everything's in a circle shape, and we've made some waffle French toast, and it's it's encrusted with some Lucky Charms, right? Yes. And then we also made a breakfast pizza, and the base sauce is a ketchup barbecue sauce as the sauce, and then there's eggs and ham and green onion bar can we get some? garnish. Visually appealing, a lot of colors available. We yes. can get enticing, yes. well plated as well. Oh, yes. Good. Thank yes. you. Good. It might be a little cold because we got so, done so much faster than the other group. Confidence, <laughs> <laughs> they already won their awards before we even tried Yes. I don't know about that. I don't know. All right. Sus. There we go. Okay, let's very colorful. Mine's very colorful, gotta say. I'm nervous about the ketchup barbecue. So. <laughs> I'm a little nervous about the Lucky Charms. <laughs> well, it looks like a thinking face. What, 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 what's what's your opinion? Face? <laughs> yeah, yeah, the barbecue looks like was honey chipotle, so it might be looking. <laughs> oh, yeah. Oh, hey! <laughs> <laughs> I have something to bring up. Uh, good, 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 good I don't know what should have been added to the Lucky Charm waffle, because it just tastes like just Lucky Charm on the surface of it, and that's it, and that's what I'm getting, is like a kind of wet Lucky Charm. Yeah, the, 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 the dominant flavor profile. <laughs> At this point, your your basic judgment is, is it edible? Yeah, yeah I mean, I'm eating it. It's great. <laughs> um, I like the cinnamon. That was a good touch to the waffle. I can't really taste the barbecue sauce, and that could just be me. Oh, I, oh, I could, can. Yeah. I, can. <laughs> I, was, I don't know I if was, I just uh, still have uh, the color taste, uh -oh. or if I just got a piece of, oh, I got a piece of just ham, that's why. We got a 2319. Oh, that's cheese on there. I can tell. That's what that 
<laughs> Way to go, guys. All right. All right. Good job, Thank you. Thank you. For our dishes, we have um, peanut butter roll. So it's basically toast with peanut butter and marshmallows in the middle. Lucky Charms is one of the main ingredients. Um, the middle one is not butter. So if you don't want to eat that, then don't. But it's around, uh, surrounded by syrup. It's a little nice touch. It's like a peninsula, like a peanut butter peninsula. And powdered sugar. And powdered sugar. 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 Yes. And then this is our uh, orange pancakes with syrup and powdered sugar. Um, initially, we were going to put marshmallows in the middle, but that didn't really work out. So we actually did not follow through with that idea. So it's just regular good old pancakes. We, we thought we put lemon in it. But, uh, oh, we actually put lime in it. Wine. So they're lime pancakes. You either pancakes or not. Who knows? Yeah. And then this is a barbecue bacon egg sandwich with a fried egg. That definitely looks like the best thing. Yeah. Yep. Let's dig in. Here, let me get in. Have a Oh, it will be. I know that that's how it this works. Works. It honestly might be the saving grace. <laughs> it could be. It really could work. Does anybody have a preference for Just eating syrup. <laughs> I know a lot of people don't prefer that. <laughs> yeah. Well, they definitely gave us a lot of money. That's true. That our money's worth. They used yeah. ingredients. I really like the sandwich. For that. yeah. that's, oh. that's excellent. Give me yeah. that's Give a Thank you. Did you put barbecue on this? Yes. This is good. It's good. I love it. <laughs> I got you. That is. <laughs> Did you run out of syrup when you dumped it all on the? <laughs> your pancakes need more syrup. That'd be my critique. But they're good. They taste all right. I could taste the lime in the pancake. I, 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 I think we have to have. And that's a little uncomfortable for me. I don't, I don't find it terrible. There's citrus pancakes. I kind of um, like the citrus. The lemon or the lime juice guy that cake is, it seems yeah. divisive. It was good. We all liked it. Oh, oh really? Well, I it really wasn't was bad. No, the citrus pancake is nice. Okay, here I think we go with the peanut butter. Would have probably been better if they would have just taken their nope. oranges. <laughs> <laughs> okay, oh you just instantly said no. Given <laughs> the, the hard pass. <laughs> that was not great. Oh, the peanut <laughs> Tell me what's wrong. Right. <laughs> marshmallow yeah, crunch. It's, it's right. <laughs> the marshmallow has a crunch to it. And the, the texture is just the peanut butter. <laughs> thank you. Yeah. A, I try. I forget. No, thank you. I try. I didn't think anybody used the Lucky Charms well, so they both equally <laughs> used Lucky Charms poorly. Putting them on waffles, the taste was mush, and then just using the marshmallows was not helpful either. So, wash on that one. Yeah, well, the only thing I would add is that I feel like the marshmallows made that pretty disgusting. Ooh. So, the peanut butter? at least with that, it wasn't like yes. awful because okay. of that. So that'd be my, that'd be my uh, feedback, okay. I guess. But. Um, okay. I thought their presentation was the best. I thought they had kind of a nice idea behind it. The, what you say, well-rounded meal. Mm -hmm. yeah. That was that was, was a good cute. idea. That was cute. It looked like you wanted to eat it, especially their it little pizza. That very they had color, very yes. colorful. The garnish helped. You couldn't really taste it, but it added that little bit of something. Right. Yeah. The pizza was good. And the breakfast pizza, whatever. That was good. Yeah. It was good. It was nice. It was edible. That's hey, that's a good start. Did yeah. either team blow you away or make you run in terror? Besides the peanut butter mess. Um, I mean that breakfast sandwich was really good. And the so they had the best, they had the best dish, and then they had the worst. Yeah, I agree. <laughs> so the breakfast you... sandwich was by far the best item that we ate, but they also had the I never want to taste that again, and I'm sad. That's the problem because they had something really good, but then we. The, if they would have left that off, it would have been a clear yeah. They would have left that off, it was definitely, yeah. Brady decided. Part of me, though, gives them some credit for trying to be creative right. and trying to just do something different. Mm -hmm. it, I did like the clementines with the pancakes. That was good. That was, that was good. My, a citrus pancake was good. Right. I was Aren't trying they? harder than a breakfast yeah. pizza that we've had that breakfast pizza. Oh, okay. right? that that's not, right. that's not a new concept, so. 
Yeah, because the breakfast sandwich was pretty typical. Movie, yeah. But the most pancakes. creative thing was the pa what? citrus pancakes then? Well, and they tried to get creative with the peanut butter. I don't think it was more effort to make a pancake from scratch than take a frozen waffle and add Lucky Charms to the exterior and then just toast it. Like making that pancake. I know it was a mix, but it was still a little bit more. I am not the foods queen. Foods queen. So after extensive deliberation, um, we all decided that Lucky Charms was not a good food to put in with anything because the Lucky Charms dishes were not so good. But Lucky Charms also aren't good. <laughs> I don't know. Everybody might disagree with that. So if we kind of throw the Lucky Charm dishes out, we are going with our group two, the breakfast sandwich. Oh my God! Yes. So good job, guys. Yes. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you, guys. <laughs> so Brady and Anna, do you guys feel like you deserve this victory? Because I have my qualms. I feel like we did deserve this victory, even though Anna was a big part of it. We all worked very hard. And I think we did a really good job, and we just want thank you, thank to thank the judges. Well, so Brady, yeah, let's, let's say we do it all again. Would you make the same mistake with the peanut butter rollers, rollers or would you? No, I would not make the same mistake. I would yeah. probably not do them at all. Can you talk about it a little more? Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> all right. Liberation, yeah. Thank you guys for joining us for this cooking competition. It was a mess from start to finish and all points in between and loaded with syrup. All right, have a good rest of your day, Alicorn, and we'll see you guys in the next pep rally.